Okay, so we're back. We've got our pal Oakland here. Hey guys! Yes, yes. Um, uh, yeah. Hey, how are you? How's your hand doing? Oh, it's wonderful. <laughs> you had some good news. Wobbling around. You had some here. good news for us. Yes, I do. I brought my brother in. No, no other good news. Oh, I'm getting my surgery. Yes. I finally got approved for a year Yay. to see a uh, plastic surgeon that I needed. Good. And you're going to have the uh, nerve reconstruction, Yes, correct? they're going to take nerves from the back of my foot and grow them into my hand. Wonderful. Yes, wonderful. it is very wonderful. Good for you. I'm excited. And you brought your brother, so we're going to just call you Brother of Oakland. Oakland's best. Oakland's best. You Do go. you mind if we share your story and your I video with all of our YouTube? Okay. No. Um, your sister, unfortunately, doesn't didn't know how to properly open a bottle of wine. <laughs> right. And has ended up with a lot of trouble with her right. wrist. And before we, you know, ask you what <laughs> happened here, I just want to know: Does this involve any kind of alcoholic beverage? No, it doesn't. I mean, you can be honest. Unfortunately, it does. It Did doesn't. you try to open beer with a firecracker? <laughs> <laughs> Did your sister do I'll, this to you? I'll we can. I plead you. the fifth. I, mean, <laughs> <laughs> I plead the fifth. All right, all right, I, uh, brother. What happened? I was cooking brisket. I took it off. Yeah. And it was in tin foil, and I had the electric shear in my left hand. Yeah. And I went to put it down, and it just turned on, and it cut, chewed up two of my fingers. It almost chewed up all of them. Yeah. Yeah. So. So, um, well, it looks like you've got pretty good movement with them all there. Right. You, you are kind of your your fingers are a little cold. Yeah. Did you have this in some kind uh, of pack or something? That's pretty yeah. tender still, huh? Yeah. How long true. ago did this happen? The second. Well, it was the twenty eighth of February. Twenty eighth of February. So we're working on a little more than a couple of weeks now. Right. And uh, it looks like you still have some of the deep stitches in. Did they remove the superficial ones? Um, I have to go back. I've been giving yeah. it that lighting. I, uh, yeah. I got I got a real bad infection in it. Yeah. And uh, I haven't really went back to uh, Ben's Hob because mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. because of that. Ben so. is, by the way, not a doctor. It's the name of a hospital. Right. In our area. Right. Yeah. I understand. I, I would. That the was hospital. for our viewers. <laughs> okay. Not for you. We know you know. Right. But, but we uh, hope you. It's know. like a butcher shop. If you can. Yeah. Can't tell. Yeah. And uh, yeah. so, so do you think there's like a genetic predisposition <laughs> I knew it. to mangling your extremities in your family? There, there very well could be. There could be. Yeah. There very well could be. You know, when you were growing up, did you idolize your older sister? I did. No, and you've kind of worked you know, to emulate her in a lot of things, haven't I, you? I have. I have. Very because well as I think about this, <laughs> I'm starting to think maybe, you know, there's a psychiatric connection. I meant psychic <laughs> connection. Right, I didn't mean right, psychiatric. psychiatric. No, it's no, a psychic, we're not crazy. No. A psychic connection. We right. just like brisket and wine. <laughs> yeah. yeah, brisket and wine. <laughs> well, and those are two of my favorite things, too. Right. Yeah. Well, I'm glad you brought your brother in for us. What are we doing for you today? Do you need some uh, um, you need something for I, that? Yes, or, sir. Uh, looks pretty good, actually. Looks like you're doing pretty well. Are you able to move those fingers? I can barely move them because it's so so small. Do you know? Did they? Did you get the tendons? Tendons. Tendons are arteries or and tendons in, in uh, my yeah. ring finger and just the, the this tendon. Yeah. 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 One of the things that as physicians, when we're, we're following up on a patient with a wound like this. Uh, we'll check for uh, capillary refill, and that means if we push, does that hurt if I do that? Uh -huh. A little bit. I'm going to try not to cause a lot of pain. But you see how we, we can make the skin blanch a little bit? Right. And if I let go, you see how it pinks up real quick? Right. That's what we call capillary refill, and we want that to be brisk. That tells us that you've got an intact blood supply. Okay. And we would do that on both of them, just real gentle, because I know that's a little bit sore. Right. And see, that, that would be a real standard test that we would right. do to make sure that your blood supply is intact. The other thing we would do is, is, is we would just touch in different areas to be sure that you know you were in uh, you were sensate that you had uh, normal sensation and then we would check for motion and, and make sure that you had full range of motion but right now you don't right. uh, and some of that's going to be pain uh, yeah there's, there's a lot of pain associated with this right here you know have you guys uh, <laughs> looked into maybe a, like a bulk deal on uh, re <laughs> rehab or you know like rehab no because you're both you know you both will need some some therapy right before this is done and yeah. uh, you know you guys could carpool. Could could carpool. You know, there's a there's a lot of green kind of uh, benefits to, to being injured together. Right. 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 Well, good deal. Um, thanks for sharing. Thank you. And uh, we'll do whatever you need uh, to get you further along the way uh, to to recovery. All right. Appreciate All right. It. Thanks. You're live. Talk to us now. Okay. Uh, I'm taking a vitamin that is. I don't know the name of the vitamin. <laughs> Start over. <laughs> I, I, 
this is just, it's embarrassing. You've been I, taking I, it for two months. You never read the label? Dr. Juice. Okay, Dr. Juice. You were taking my Meta 7. Okay, I am taking Meta 7. Yeah. And so far that I've noticed uh, within uh, the first couple of months that I've been taking it, okay, that I do wake up. I do feel, when I do take it in the morning, I do feel a little bit more energetic, like a, I don't know, a little more alert, yeah, energetic. More alert. Mm -hmm. um, is it natural or jittery? Uh, no, it's great. I mean, it's, it's not just like, like it's, no. You don't feel like you just swig down ten cups of coffee. Though. No, absolutely. You not. feel good. No, I feel. I actually, I feel good. I, yeah, I feel good. I feel you know. And then uh, I also noticed that I haven't really changed my diet habits, mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. so actually, I eat kind of. You know, I enjoy things. You know, I eat mm -hmm. my dessert, and I haven't gained weight. In fact, so. I just checked your chart. You did lose one pound. I mean, it's amazing. I cannot believe that that has happened. Okay, because I do enjoy my life. I mean, I enjoy it. So, anyway, uh, so it's been good. I ha I, and I'm going to keep and continue. And I'm, I, I think that, uh, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what, what happens. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for the... <laughs> I don't know. We'll see. Yeah, okay, hold on. Well, you know, I'm just saying, now, I don't mean it that way. What I do mean is, is that I like to give a product and I will take a product mm -hmm. if it continues to benefit me. And right now I am getting the benefit from that, it. That's all we like can I ask. I feel some benefits. That's okay. all we can ask. Thank and that's you. Did you lose a chicken? You lost two chickens. Yeah. They like him because she has one of these roosters too because I gave her one of those roosters. Yeah. Uh-oh, we're going to find out why the chicken crossed the road to get away from Jill.